Sammy, you were in Minsk in 2014 for the first ever CHL group stage draw. How do you see the progress the competition has made since then? And what do you think it brings to European hockey? Well, I think it brings a lot. Like the competition level right now is is getting way better. It was 2014. Uh, I think that time and the teams were kind of in the worst of something new. So they were excited, but didn't know what to expect. And now after uh, basically eight years, uh, everybody's so excited to be part of it. It means that, that you have had a really good season to uh, enter into uh, this season's uh, Champions Hockey League. So uh, I think it means a lot for the teams, for the fans. Uh, the fans have found uh, the Champions Hockey League, so I'm, I'm happy with that. And uh, same time, it's just, uh, I would say this year, is level is, the play is going to be better than ever. We're going to have uh, plenty of uh, the former KSL players, NHL players are returning back to uh, Europe. So uh, the level is going to be high, and I'm so excited to start watching in the September. We know many young players got the chance to show their skill in the CHL, such as Patrick Laine, Rasmus Dahlin, and others. Do you see the CHL as the perfect place to develop young talent while playing against the best teams in Europe? I think it's a great opportunity for young players. It's basically having an extra international games. They uh, top talents that they are playing at their youth uh, national team games on the international level, but they get to play with the men's in the international level. So that's a major difference. And uh, talents like uh, Patrick Line in the former years, like uh, you can show uh, what you're capable in the 17 before you're trapped or right after that you've been drafted, that uh, how good you are already and uh, what is your purpose and uh, on your career. So uh, I think it's a major opportunity for uh, young players uh, to showcase themselves in the Champions Hockey League. And how important is international hockey, not only for the development of young players, but also for development of the clubs and improvement of European hockey in general? Well, I think it means a lot. Uh, I, I think it's uh, helping us to uh, create the better culture. And uh, you can always, when you're visiting and uh, playing in a different places, you can uh, copy some of the things that uh, maybe the other team uh, is uh, doing on uh, game events and uh, how the fans are behaving and reacting in the game so you can catch something uh, for your own organization and uh, kind of bring it to your own use and uh, that way uh, I think it helps a lot at the same time I, I think it's uh, Champions Hockey League is uh, solidifying uh, the financial situation uh, for the top teams too and uh, it's uh, easier for clubs to find sponsors and uh, investors to, uh, to be becoming a part of uh, the club uh, once uh, you get to play in a uh, high level like a Champions Hockey League. Sammy, thank you. Thank you.